one sector you can fish out to say if the incoming and the administration can also set their eyes on this sector to revamp it up, Nigeria can be transformed from a developing country to a developed country. What se other sector would you think for example? I think it's the banking sector. Uh, because, look, the biggest problem in Nigeria is lack of credit. You want to buy a house, you have to pay for everything up front. You want to buy a car, you have to pay for everything up front. You, everything you do, you know, you, even there's not a credit card, the credit card system is not, you know, available in Nigeria. You have a debit card. So we need to introduce a credit system into Nigeria so that people can pay for things over time. It's not easy. You want to buy a house for 20 million and they expect to come up with the 20 million. You want to buy a land for 10 million, you have to come up with the cash. That restricts the growth of the economy because if you can pay 1 million and get a mortgage for 9 million, it makes it easier. And you pay for your 9 million over time. So that's what is done all over the world. The credit system is what drives the economy in the US, in the UK and everything. So we need to introduce the credit system into Nigeria so that you don't have to come up with 100% cash for everything you buy. You know, it will even reduce corruption because the pressure on you to buy your car, to buy a house will be reduced. And it will also stimulate the economy because now a lot of people can go buy cars. A lot of people can go buy houses. And the, with the multiplier effect, if the house, housing uh, is booming, all the uh, furniture companies will have to produce more furniture. All the uh, appla uh, appliances, all the bricks, all the mortars, everything the multiplier effect will be so so high. In fact, in the US, the economy is driven by the mortgage uh, sector. And we need to introduce something. And I'm so happy that the president-elect has been talking about this, and it's a priority for him. And I remember uh, there was a speech he gave at a hotel during the campaign, and he elaborated on this extensively. So I believe, I believe the president-elect and his team are aware of this and they are ready to do something to, you know, to make this happen.